Okay, I'm gonna teach you how to make an origami T-Rex. Um, if you cut your paper with me earlier, you're gonna already have the crease in your paper diagonally across. If you did not, go ahead and fold your paper diagonally in half so that you can get that crease. You're gonna open it up and you're gonna fold it in half diagonally the other way. That way when you open it up, you're gonna have an X in the middle of your paper. Then you're gonna fold it in half from straight side to a straight side so that you get a horizontal crease or a line across the middle of your paper. And then you're gonna fold it in half vertically so that you get a fold mark that goes up and down the middle of your paper. So whenever you open it up, you should have folds in an X and then folds in a plus sign as well, okay? You're gonna go ahead and fold it back in half this way. That way you'll have the fold on the top, the opening at the bottom, and you're going to take this top right corner and fold it back along this crease line that you already have in half like this. Okay, then you're going to flip it over and you're gonna do the same thing on this side. Go ahead and turn it up so that you can open up the middle of it. When you open up the middle, you'll see that you have this folded flap here, this folded flap here, and what you're gonna do is you're gonna push it and because you made those other folds, it's just gonna collapse into itself so that you have this diamond like this. You're gonna have the closed side on top, open side on the bottom. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna take this edge right here and you're going to fold it so that it meets this middle crease line and creates a point down here at the bottom. Just fold the top piece of the paper, not the bottom one. Then you're gonna take this side and you're gonna do the same. Then you're going to take this top part and you're going to fold it down just right here where the tops of these pieces of paper are. And you're gonna lift it back up, that way you get a fold, okay? Now you're gonna open this back up and you're gonna place a finger back here on this fold, this way you know where it opens and where you're gonna fold this paper. So when you open it up, Keep that part down. You're going to try to flip this so that it goes inside now. So what you're going to do is kind of press on this fold here in the middle and press those down and you're going to do the same thing on this side. So you're not making any new folds, they're just going to be the same ones that you already had. and then you should be able to close it like that. You're gonna flip it over and we're gonna do the same thing on this side. So you're gonna take this straight edge and fold it into your center line. We're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Fold that down just so that you can make sure you have the crease. Open it back up. Remember, you're gonna hold along this fold. Okay, flip these pieces inside. And then close that down. Okay, so you should have a couple of open pieces down at the bottom, point at the top. Okay, you're gonna take one of these sides and you're going to lift it up so that it's open. You're going to take this top part so that this edge 
folds right along this line here. And then you're going to lift it up and you're going to do the same thing on this side. So you're going to make sure that this edge folds right along this side. That way when you open it back up, you're going to have a couple of these creases. You're going to fold this so that it closes. So it kind of sticks out like that. I'm going to show you from all angles. Okay. And then what you're going to do is you're going to fold the rest of this in half. So now it kind of looks like a bird. This top part is going to be our head. So what you're going to do is you're going to fold it forward. And because, um, the T-Rex has a flat nose. So what you're going to do is you're going to fold it back again. Okay. When you open it back up, you're going to open this part of the head. Actually, sorry. First, you're going to open it this way. You're going to kind of pop this up so that you can flip this piece around so it goes in the opposite direction. And then you're going to fold this part of the nose inside. If you can't get that part, honestly, you can kind of leave it where it was before and just tuck the nose in. If you can get it, great. So now you should have this flat nose. It kind of looks like that if you did it correctly. And we're going to do something similar with our t-rex hands but i'm just going to press down in the middle here until i get a little fold with the arm piece sticking out okay so now i've got my little t-rex arms here got my t-rex head okay so next you should have three pieces in the back here you're going to take your front one and you're going to fold it down. This is going to be one of your legs. The middle one is going to stay straight for a tail. Go ahead and flip to the other side. And you're going to turn this side down as well. Okay. And then the last thing that we're going to do is fold your T-Rex's legs. We're going to give him his feet by just folding forward like this. And then you're going to fold this side forward as well. Okay, so now you've got your T-Rex and some of them will stand, some of them won't. You can add little eyes or a mouth or any kind of designs that you want.